Today, we talk about... <laughs> yo, yo, Kyle, <laughs> sir. All right, uh, let's get it. <laughs> so, uh, I've been made to do this, I think, a couple years now, but finally making the time for it this year. And um, I always thought this could be an interesting uh, discussion, so uh, let's just jump right into it. Met Gala every year. You see these uh, wacky out there-ish. Uh, and um, these outfits are uh, worth reviewing from my perspective. So uh, let's get right into it. Uh, every year there's a theme. Uh, last year I believe it was Catholicism or, uh, or just straight up Christianity. Either way, this year it's a camp, which uh, I tried looking up Vogue's definition for it. And it was just like paragraphs and paragraphs of like, what are we talking about here? But then I just quickly look it up and it's just... Another way of saying uh, exaggerated for effect, kind of like campy humor or whatever. So uh, it's very deliberate out there exaggeration, which is pretty much this, describing all of this fashion. So uh, <laughs> let's get right into it. We're not really going to be ranking them. We're just, you know, first impression thoughts of these outfits. So first up, boom. Uh, don't know who this is. So let's read the caption here. Kalila and Paco Raban. Uh, I hope I didn't butcher the names. But, uh, but yeah, I, I do dig these. I remember my mom rocking something like this uh, when I was a kid uh, to like a wedding or something and it had like all the, all the little, uh, you know, fish scales on them. So I'm digging this. It's like a disco vibe, you know what I mean? All right, next, uh, let's go with, also don't know who this is, Lana Condor, Lena, sorry, don't know your real name, uh, in Giambattista Jamba, Valley Haute Couture, wearing Lark and Berry jewelry. Ooh. Fancy. Uh, this is interesting. It's almost like uh, like a oversized sweater turned ballerina dress up top, and like a lawnmower going over the front of the dress and the bottom with the back super duper longness hanging out in the back. I don't know how better to describe this, but uh, I don't know. Women. I gotta salute you for pulling off ish like this. Like this seems like the most annoying thing to wear, but it definitely carries a little bit of that elegance. So uh, props to you. All right, next. Ooh, uh, who's this? Maluma in Moschino by Jeremy Scott. Okay, Jeremy Scott. Jeremy Scott, I feel like would be perfect for this uh, camp theme because uh, some of the ish I saw here was wild. And, and this comparatively is <laughs> fairly tame. Uh, for someone like Jeremy Scott, which probably tells you how wild this camp theme was. Uh, we'll be seeing some uh, some wacky-ish uh, coming up, but I really do like this. It's got like, um, <sighs> I want to say Victorian era. I don't know my eras, but uh, it's got like that shortened blazer up top with the flow in the back, even though I can't fully see the flow. The oversized sleeve, usually not a fan of that, but it kind of works here because everything going crazy here. Uh, plus you add in the jewelry, and uh, I'm not a big bow tie guy, but this whole theme really works. And this cummerbund, digging it, digging it. I love this shade of taupe or canvas or whatever. Uh, moving right along. Again, the long flowing dresses. I don't know how you women do it. I don't know how you don't get stepped on and, and trip over or have other people trip over you and all that is, but it is what it is. Uh, this being Adwa Abwa in Diane von Furstenberg wearing John Hardy earrings and an area headpiece. Cool. Uh, huh. Interesting makeup. Uh, I wonder what the thought was between the makeup and the uh, Jaguar spots. I do dig the Jaguar spots. I've always thought that this was like a cool look on women. Um, but uh, but yeah, just, man, these long flowing dresses, I don't even know, man. I don't even know. Next, who is this? This is a Pedro Pascal in Burberry. Burberry, always very tame uh, because of that English proper... Um, uh, reserved a uh, conservative style and uh, perfectly reflected here. Uh, uh, compare that uh, as a juxtaposition with the two outfits in the background uh, compared to the foreground. And uh, you see here that this is uh, quite the uh, tame fit uh, for this evening. Uh, but yeah, I dig it. Uh, it's like that camel collar, you know what I mean? All right, next. Oh, an ad, great. Not brought to you by Tiffany. I ain't got no sponsors on this ish. All right, who's this? Another very reserved looking thing. Uh, thing. Oh, surprise, Burberry. Uh, Alexander Skarsgård. Cool. Yeah, man, just <laughs> straight up tux. <laughs> and you know what's hilarious? In the theme of camp, this is almost like, because I feel like a part of camp is, is definitely a little bit of irony. And uh, this is fully ironic that like the most basic outfit for a gala 
in this setting becomes the most standout-ish because people are looking at him like, oh shit, he wore like a regular thing. <laughs> anyway, all right, who do we got here? Do we got Naomi Scott and Burberry? Okay, so now on the women's side, a little bit less conservative. Uh, usually not a fan of the, uh, the blue uh, shading in the eyes or whatever you makeup ladies call them, uh, but this is actually very tasteful. Although I don't see it up close. I mean, maybe I wouldn't like it as much up close, but this, this works, I think. Um, I'm loving this dude in the background. Who is this? Matthew McConaughey? <laughs> uh, no. Uh, yeah, this is, uh, I like the little dangly. The little danglies are cool. Um, and then, like, some pretty basic pants, I want to say. But, again, it's kind of tough to tell from this angle. Idiot, what are you? Now, what do we got here? Lizzo and Marc Jacobs. I would not expect this kind of wildness from a Marc Jacobs. But, hey, this is giving me, like, a pl flamingo pimp vibes. You know what I mean? <laughs> Uh, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Okay. It's like a basic dress underneath, but then with the, yeah, with the, uh, flamingo, uh, pimp, uh, up top. Yeah. Cool. Cool. All right. Who's this? Billy Lulid and Zach Posen. Never heard of these. Uh, but yeah, another basic one, like a very, um, simple wedding day in the olden era type vibes, type teens. Now, uh, Charlotte Tilbury and Zach Posen. Again, Seems like Zach Posen went the more conservative route. Maybe he just didn't get the memo. Am I right? Am I right? All right, now let's keep it moving. Uh, oh, another ad. Great. Skip. Number 11, we got uh, Deepika Padukone and Zach Posen. Wow, more Zach Posen. This one seems a little bit more out there. Love the, the ribbage in the dress. That's cool. Uh, digging the hairstyle. Very, uh, what are we going to say? 60s? 70s? Something like that. Yeah. Okay, next. Uh, ooh, this really pops to me. Jordan Dunn and Zach Posen. Okay, Zach Posen. All right, stepping it up a little bit here. Okay, or was he playing playing favorites with the different uh, folks he modeled? I don't know. I don't know. But perfect shading of the, the dress with the um, with the shoes. Uh, and, dude, this is like a perfect flower petal. This is dope. Cool, man. I like this. And her skin tone is, like, perfect for this dress. I can't pick. Eh, I guess I could picture, like, a pasty white check wearing this too but uh but she really pulls this off man all right all right next what do we got swiss beats hey with alicia keys okay i should have suspected that but so many wild characters uh huh yeah this seems a little bit more reserved love the uh not fully matching green but still green tones type things cool 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 another flowing dress don't know how y'all do it uh who this new phone uh lily rose depp in chanel is this Johnny Depp's daughter or some ish? It's got to be, right? Jimmy Choo Shoes. All right, well, Jimmy Choo's always come prepared. And, hey, I'm loving the uh, the matching with the uh, with the chines. Multiple chines. Uh, yeah, pretty cool. I like this. And then otherwise simple black underneath, highlighting the chines. I like it. I like it all at all. Uh, who this? Misha Nonu. So we get, huh? Interesting sleeves, interesting sleeves. But I uh, wonder how she ate dinner. Does she have to like pin them back? Gotta ask her. She reminds me of like uh, Lumiere from uh, Beauty and the Beast. Uh, oh, you know, Kanda is coming from my uh, my hoof. <laughs> uh, another ad. Okay, back to this. So what do we got? Tom Brown, Amy Fine Collins. Okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> All right, well, listen guys, uh, this is interesting. But uh, I think we need to st uh, speed this up because we got a ton of images to go through. Uh, Travis Scott. Got to gotta give Travis Scott a quick shine here. Uh, Travis Scott and Dior. Okay, okay. I would not expect this super militarized look from Dior, even though I don't got a ton of experience with him. Uh, but hey, you know, Travis Scott, on fire right now. La Flamme. La Flamme. Uh, always crushing it. So, default win. Uh, who this? Who this? Uh, Stella Maxwell. Interesting, but not going to focus on this one. Huh. Okay. OBJ back at him again. Um, I'm digging those boots, actually. Those are very aggressive looking boots. I would not wear them with shorts, but I'm just not a big shorts guy. But maybe he wants to show off the tats and the calves, you know what I mean? Um, same thing with the sleeveless. I get it. It definitely works for this theme with the can. But then again, almost any, anything works for this theme. Am I all right? Um, hmm. I do miss my best days. Those are those are from good days back in medical school. Uh, next, what do we got? Who is this firefighter? Congresswoman Carolyn Maloney. Interesting. Uh, is this part of her agenda? Save the firefighter budget or something-ish? I don't know. But uh, interesting shade of vault. 
Nike triggered. Hey, yo. Uh, now, who do we got? Um, let's see. Let's see. Who this? Mark Ronson and Valentino. Again, pretty muted, but I do like the blue accents. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, who this? Who this? Irina Shake in Burberry. Um, not as conservative. A very deep V. Uh, bros on Jersey Shore triggered. Uh, interesting uh, medallion or whatever at the base. Um, Hmm. What is that? What is that? Velvet! <laughs> All right, who next? Ooh, is this Sama or Penelope? This looks like Penelope. Whoops, am I right? Come on. Yeah, I got them. Chanel and Christian Louboutin and uh, Swarovski uh, jewelry. Interesting. Yeah, again, uh, very classic campy, if you will, if I can give it that title. You got these double layered cones of black and then this white top. Cool. Uh, but she looks elegant and everything, am I right? Uh, okay, who do we got next? This is Rita Ora. Hmm. Kind of muted. Meh. Meh. Uh, Halsey. Wow, Halsey, I feel like every time I see a picture of her, she's in a different hair color. This is giving me like Wonder Woman vibes, so probably just from the jewelry and then that red tonage. Uh, compared to like maybe an Amazonian something-something woman who happens to love red. I don't know, but hey, classic. And it is my favorite color, so yeah. Uh, who this? Who this? Uh, Josephine Skyver. Loving the colors. Loving the colors. Uh, let's see. This also looks fairly basic, but I do like the added piece right there. Whoever you are, you are Regina King. Okay. Uh, let's see. Who this? Who this? Uh, Taylor Hill. Ralph Laurent. Ralph Warren. Interesting. Looks very chic with a little poof poof to it. Okay. Ah, we got some men back in here. Naoki, Kobayashi, and Tom Ford. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this looks very Tom Ford. And the perfect amount of camp that I would expect Tom Ford to uh, dish out for an event like this. So, yeah, very classy, yet very uh, refined and campy. Nice job, Tommy. Uh, can I call you Tom? I don't know. Uh, Lively Lily Collins uh, in Jean-Baptiste Valley Haute Couture wearing Cartier Jewelry. And then, again, more flowage, more flowage. And giving me a uh, Megan from a uh, Mad Men vibes. Cool. No photos, please. Fascinating. Who's who's this? Haley Steinfield. Oh, why do I remember that name? Some musician, right? Yeah. Uh, ooh, that's that girl from um, Aziz and Sorry stuff. Yeah, Lena Lena Waithe and Kirby Jean uh, Raymond uh, Raymond, both in custom Pyre Moss wearing David Yerman jewelry. Cool, man. Yo, she actually crushed this fit. I'm not even gonna lie. Hmm. It's like very over the top, but not like too over the top. And then with that, you got to go with those shoes, right? Although I would have loved the red on her, but again, I'm just biased because I'm into red. But hey, yo, uh, let's see, let's see. Skip this ad. Uh, meh, okay. Jonas Brothers, and who's the chick? Uh, Sophie Turner, okay. Like the matchy matchy. Love color blocking. Color blocking has been kind of in lately, at least from what I've noticed, but dope. Um, who is this? Uh, what's her name? What's her name? Yeah, Emma Roberts. I knew it. I just didn't know it. Uh, cool. Cool. Okay. Uh, Janelle Monet in Christian Seriano. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, it's like a face. It's like a Picasso. Hey, oh, hey. I like it. I like it. Um, this is giving me, not Roger Rabbit vibes, but um, Bullwinkle, that cartoon. Yeah. Violet Tchotchke. Uh, okay. All right. Can't go wrong with black, am I right? Come on, you gonna close or what, bro? Okay, what is going on? Okay, next uh, we got Solange Knowles. I could have swore I saw some Beyonce in her face, but uh, yeah, again, another muted uh, snake skinniness. Cool, get it, skinny? <laughs> All right, next, uh, who this? Cara Delevingne and Christian Dior. Okay, uh, hmm. This is a candy cane trigger. Yeah, okay. Although the multicolored ones always taste better than the regular ones. Uh, don't at me. Uh, who this? This is that actress, Jennifer Connelly. Yeah, Louis Vuitton. Cool. Color blocking. Telling you. Hey, yo. Um, Seth Myers and I'm assuming his wife, Alexi Ash Myers. Yeah. Uh, interesting red boppage on uh, Seth over here. Uh, this is very funny. Trevor Noah in off white. So good job, Virgil. This is all the formality. Cool, cool, cool. Had to show him off. Superman, dad, ho, right? Um, who this? Uh, Diane von Furstenberger. Oh, interesting. So, again, very exaggerated, very campy, and a New York reference. That. All right, next. Uh, Meh. 
Seems pretty uh, pretty typical. Who is this? Uh, Nina Dobrev. Zach Posen again. Zach Posen with the uh, classic ish. These legs are for days. Noise. Um, love the little uh, thingy on her leggy. Uh, huh. Interesting earring. I like it. Look at this. India Moore and Louis Vuitton. Okay, Louis Vuitton coming in, coming in. Uh, who are you? Uh, Stefano Tonchi and uh, Tonki and uh, Hikari Mori and Tori Birch. Cool. Again, fairly muted though. You know. Uh, who dis? Uh, Camila Mendez uh, and Prabal Gurung and Jimmy Choo shoes and Charles Melton and Sees Marjan. Okay. Who dis? Uh, I'm not sure, but this. See, now things are starting to blend together because there's so much wildness. That's why I'm telling you, that tuck stood out immediately. Uh, this is also the actress. Eh, eh, not bad. Uh, yeah, same. A lot of pops of pink. Uh, some uh, flufferiness to the sides, but uh, I'm just running out of adjectives here. Uh, who is this? Uh, Donatella Versace. Interesting, interesting. A lot of lime green. Lime green. It's like a uh, Lamborghini green. Uh, interesting bodysuit. That's some wow, this it's like a fruity pebbles bodysuit. I'm digging it. It's uh, she has a hard time messing up. She's uh, she's been killing it lately. Uh, who this? That's that actress again, kind of eh, the heart, the bleeding heart, or the crying heart. Kind of interesting. Kind of interesting. Oh, Colin, my boy, miss you on the Niners, buddy. Uh, Nessa Diab, okay. Again, fairly muted, but you get that gold and black uh, theme. Maybe the whole uh, black, li not black lives matter, but uh, black pride. I feel like these are very black pride colors. Uh, let's see, let's see. Laura Roach and Zendaya and Tommy Hilfiger. Okay, Tommy Hilfiger making an appearance. Okay, I see. What is this, uh, Disney princess vibes? Okay. Uh, who is this? Uh, Kate Moss. Okay, okay. Hmm. Again, more sheeniness. All monochromatic. Can't go wrong with that. Interesting. The oh, I just noticed the hair stuff. <laughs> Are those like baby hands? That's amazing. Ooh, and the purse to match. Hey, yo, I'm digging it. All right. Ooh, now this is a little aggressive. Is that real hair? Because if so, that's that's nuts. Who's this? Who this? Actually, who's this? Let's find out. I want to give this woman a little shine here. Lup oh, that's Lupita. Okay, okay, Versace. Um, who this? Tessa Thompson in Chanel. Interesting, interesting. Okay, all right. Uh, who this? I think I recognize him. Tory Birch and Tory Birch. Oh, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Ah, uh, uh, okay. I saw these pictures on Instagram. I was like, I wonder what concert this is. But nope, because it's the Met Gala. Nikki, right? Yeah, just making sure. And Prabal Gurung. Hey, nice. Another flower. Come on, another flowing dress. Cool. Uh, hey, Tom Ford. Don't. Dun, 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 dun. Gemma Chan and Tom Ford. Cool. Yeah, always elegant. See, he doesn't mess around, this Tom Ford guy. He knows what he knows, and that's that. Hey, love it. I uh, got to get a tux from Tom Ford at some point. Uh, Ezra Miller in Burberry. Interesting uh, eye makeup, I suppose. I'm guessing the real eyes are right there. And, uh, oh, and a mask. Great. More confusion. And some Beetlejuice vibes. All right. <laughs> All right, so we're talking Bella Hadid, and who's the dude? Uh, the dude is... Uh, and Jeremy Scott, interesting. Okay, I see you, Jeremy Scott. Typical for Jeremy Scott. Wouldn't expect anything less. I like the matchiness. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, oh, who is that? That's the girl from Jurassic Park 2, uh, Lost World. Julianne Moore, yeah, yeah, yeah. Valentino, okay. Eh, she pulls it off, you know, the emerald and the... And the, uh, yeah, you know. Uh, let's see. Uh, t -t -t Julia Garner. Interesting. Man, I, I, I do like these. Uh, I do like the flow. I do like the flow. Okay. Who next? Uh, who this? Who this? Who this? Katie Holmes. Okay. 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 Uh, who this? Lala Anthony. Okay. I should have recognized her. Ooh, dollar dollar bills, y'all. Interesting theme. Plus the coinage up top. Perfect with the skin tone. Love this. Hey, yo. Um, Seems like some basic black with a bow tie that's uh, crooked. <laughs> uh, nope, that's not what I want. I want this. Interesting. Who this? Sophie von Helsenberg and uh, Bette Midler. Interesting. Phoenix. Triggered. All right. Uh, hey, our boy Tommy and his wifey. 
Il elegant simplicity. Pure elegance. Hey, um, let's see. Ah, here we go. Uh, a Jenner sister. I didn't mind this. It was very uh, cockatooey with a with an orange eating problem. <laughs> um, let's see. Jeremy Scott and Gwen Stefani. Gwen Stefani again. More flowage. Everyone loves the flowage, huh? <laughs> Jesus, Cardi B coming through. How do you even walk? Like, how many people? Yeah, are these? I'm guessing. I'm telling you, all these dudes in the back. That was their full time job that night was to just carry this carpet, this circle carpet. Everywhere. Who made this? Tom Brown. Interesting. Would not have guessed Tom Brown, but them hips though. God damn. Interesting. Interesting. I would love to hear about the inspiration of that dress. God damn. Uh, who this? Who this? This be Sama Hayek. Okay. I, I, I wanted to guess that, but the, the makeup kind of threw me off. Interesting. Okay. And then now we got, what's her face? Uh, blurred Lines, Emily Radikowski and Dundas. Interesting, interesting little uh, fairy, fairy dust theme-ish, Tinkerbell. Uh, who dis? Ah, J-Lo and uh, A-Rod. Hmm. Give me Cleopatra vibes for some reason, but I'm digging that tux, man. That's a perfect shade of pink. Uh, who dis, who dis, who dis? This is a Ciara. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. Like the pot. That's a great shade of green right there. I like that. I like that. Who this? Who these women? Uh, Candace Swain Pole and Joan Smalls. Interesting. They are not small though. They are tall AF. I can just tell. Uh, those are some model legs right there. They're just like, psh, boom. Who uh, this? It's a lot of layers. Uh, Ella Belinska. Yeah, that is crazy. I don't know how you. How you walking that? But that's I would love to see that in motion, you know. Uh, ooh, there's the other Jenner, Kylie. Yeah, I, I like the photo of them together because it's like, uh, who who put that meme up on Instagram with uh, Dumb and Dumber uh, in their outfits at their gala? <laughs> Super dope. Okay, who this? Ah, Wonder Woman. Also very uh, simplistic. I don't mind it. Perfect for her though. Perfectly fits her personality. I would say. Uh, this too, very simple. I almost thought those were Air Max 97s. Interesting. Um, cool, simplistic triangles. Okay, okay. Another very simplistic thing with a lot of colors to it. Very springish. What is this, a flying saucer as a purse? Huh. I do like the boots though, that's cool. Alicia Vikander and uh, Vikander. I don't know. Hey, who this? Another simplistic one, is that Emma Stone? Yeah, it was, wow. All this makeup's throwing me off, but uh, cool. Very Emma Stoney, I would say. Yeah. Uh, Post Malone triggered. Uh, who this? Who this? Oh, yeah, that actress from that show. Uh, huh. Interesting. Portraitage. Okay. Okay. And uh, it's that uh, that other model that I saw in a photo with Kobe Bryant. This is also quite extra, but uh, I feel like I've seen even more extra. That's that's when you know you've seen a ton of these. Ones. These really start to blend together. Uh, who's this Barbie, though? Is this uh, Casey Mus Musgraves? Never heard of her. Uh, they are very Barbie vibe type things. Um, Iron Man's girl right here. Uh, yeah, very simplistic, but perfect for her. Uh, who this? Who this? Who this? Another Jonas brother. Uh, quite muted, I would say, for, on his standpoint, especially standing next to her. Uh, oh, that's Priyanka Chopra. That's his wife. What? See, I'm telling you, man, the, the makeup's throwing me off. Who this? Oh, God. Yeah, Katy Perry. Dude. I saw her walking in this in a video. It just seems impossible. It's just like, what? And then you can't sit down and, oh, she is so beautiful though. So beautiful. Uh, okay, finally, here we go. Kanye and Kim. Okay, okay. Even her dress last year was a similar like brownish goldish type ting and uh, it was uh, very, quite muted I would say, but it stood out just because it was Kim, right? Uh, Kanye doing his thing, very uh, Janet. Is that a Dickies? Outfit? If so, yo, props to him. We gotta look at the shoes too, though. What are these? These Yeezy seen or something? I don't know, but uh, it looks clean cut in here. I dig it. Okay. Okay. Actually, what are they wearing? I should say, right? Manfred Thierry. Muggler. Okay. Okay. Uh, huh. Yeah. A lot of black. Contrasted with a lot of, uh, are they flowers? They look like flowers. I like this. I like this. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I don't know who this is. I'm guessing in a Hadid, yep, a Gigi Hadid. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, this is very extra. Uh, seems like it's very hot, too. <laughs> I'll be sweating my balls off. Uh, who this, who this, who this? Um, 
Lucy Boynton, okay, okay, don't know who that is, but doesn't seem that extra either, uh, which is not a bad thing, right? It's not like you gotta out extra each other, but hey, it seemed to be the theme of the night. Okay, Michael B. Jordan, all black air thing with a lot of uh, interesting details there. Cool, 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 okay, okay, okay. Who dis? Alexa Chung, huh, okay, whoops. Uh, huh, interesting, cool. Yeah, very muted. I would not expect uh, that to be defined as campy, but maybe for her it is. Who knows? Uh, same thing with this one. Who's this? Charlotte Kassiragi. Okay. Uh, same thing with this one. This gives me very 70s vibes. Whoever this is. L. Fanning. Oh, this is L. Fanning. Why do I recognize that name? Fanning Pants, am I right? Hey, yo. And then who's here? We got uh, Cole Sprouse. Okay, okay. Seems very muted. Same thing with this. Seems very muted. Zoe Saldana. Okay. But beautiful as always. Uh, who this? Oh, Haley Bieber. Okay. See, I'm telling you, man, the makeup's throwing me off. Ah, the classic backless dress. You know, I never understood that. It wasn't really my cup of tea. But then again, I'm also not a lady. Uh, and last but not least for this section, because this is getting long. Uh, we gonna go with... Really? 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 Come on, man. All right, you know what? I guess even my phone got overwhelmed, so uh, we're not going to get to the full 100. We'll just say 99 because uh, Jay-Z triggered, you know. Uh, but, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, new territory for me. I had fun. Hope you all did, too. Uh, maybe I'll do a part two with the rest, but I don't know, man. Those were pretty campy, pretty wild. Uh, History hyenas triggered. Um, yeah, cool. Bye. Peace.